Have you guys noticed that we're seeing a lot of stuff in 2024 that would have took 20 years to witness in your lifetime? I feel like we've got 20 years of drama in a matter of two years. UK is halfway on fire, bro. I don't know what the heck is going on, but take a look at this right here. About the breaking news in Leeds. This Leeds. attack on the police. Uh, police were called to a disturbance at five o'clock. And then all broke loose in the centre of Leeds. There has been this significant attack. Uh, so it just is the way it often is now in towns and city centres across the United Kingdom, where people are anti-police, where people are anti-the state, where people are going to attack. Now, some of you are going to see uh, this, other people are going to listen to it, but um, but let me tell you what it is. For Turned those it who over. are familiar with Yorkshire, it's the traditional terrace houses that you would see in a central uh, Leeds or central Bradford location. They are red brick. Um, uh, they're red brick houses, and it's a predominantly, I would say, Asian clientele who are attacking the police. I use that word as politely as I can. But look, what has happened, it seems from the footage, and by the way, I can't tell you uh, the precise details, but it seems from the footage that what has happened is the police have dared to break up some form of criminality, uh, real... So or this is like the hood up in the UK somewhere, and they don't F with the police. I thought that was an American thing. But somewhere in the UK with the brown mother figures, the... Uh, they said uh, there's a lot of uh, Islamic. There's a lot of people with the Islamic religion over there, and they don't mess with the games. I thought the George Floyd had power on, uh, over the world. He showed the world that people of color don't have with the police. And in America, black people. I didn't know it was getting down like that in the UK, but I'm going to give you guys a glimpse of the aftermath of what happened. There's stuff on Twitter. Social media has a lot of the real stuff. So here's what it looks like. <laughs> That no is way. the police. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. They're, they're running. No way. No way. They're fleeing. Still throwing stuff at them. They're running. They're leaving. Out of there. Oh my day! No way! It's like they just won a freaking war. That was the police just fleeing, bro. They ran. So allegedly the police commander says, retreat. Get out of there. This is in the UK, bro. The aftermath, a lot of those houses are burned down. It does look like a war. What is happening in the world, man? This isn't just an America thing, bro. We're in the end times. It feels like the end game, bro. This is happening not just in America. It's everywhere. Like, first world countries is going through this, bro. And I understand, like, with the UK, it's not the same. <laughs> the police in the UK isn't the same as the LAPD or the NYPD, right? You know, we... I feel like we're harder, we're tougher, we're, we're stronger, we're, we're, we're more But bro, they just had rocks, bro. They was just running from rocks and they left the, the town. The heck is going on out here? What is going, what is in the air, bro? Am I missing something? What's in the air that's making motherfuckers crazy? This is crazy. All going down like this, man. Y'all ran? The cops ran? I could only imagine if they had straps. They would have been sh some of them police. 
Even after this, after those police left the city, they started to set ablaze the houses. A lot of that is on fire right now as we speak, or burning or burned down to the ground. That was civil unrest. And the cops said, you know what? We're out. I just thought that was out here. I got some people from the UK in the chat. I didn't even know it was going down like that, bro. I just saw a police retreat. That's crazy. I know they have different gun laws and stuff like that, but to see, I they got a whole place of brown motherfuckers, bro, who said, get the heck up out of your throat, and then they start cheering. Yeah, we got rid of them. It must feel good when you throwing stuff at people. When, I, when you throwing stuff at cops and they running, that does gotta feel some type of liberate. Like you just won a war. Like freaking Braveheart when you freaking won at Falkirk. Just put the sword in the sky. Yeah. But that's still crazy, man, to see. Have you guys noticed that we're seeing a lot of stuff in 2024 that would have took 20 years to witness in your lifetime? I feel like we've got 20 years of drama in a matter of two years. I feel like I remember the 90s, bro. I remember what it was like in the 2000s, the early 2000s. I remember what it was like, even in some of the 2010s. The world wasn't this crazy. You wouldn't see stuff like that. And we're getting, I feel like we're getting desensitized to some of it. And if we get desensitized to certain things, that's, that's gonna spell doom for us all. I feel like we've seen enough for the rest of the century. From tooth from the year two, I ain't even gonna add two thousand. All right, from the year two thousand to the year two thousand and twenty-four, we should be done. We've had a century's worth of events, of of chaos, of bad. Shit. We've had our full, and we still got seventy-six years more in this century to go, bro. A small part of me somewhere doesn't want to know what the rest of those seventy-six years look like. I don't know how you guys feel, but those 76 years of the future kind of scare me. Let's pretend like the last 76 years will happen. Like, we'll be here. What does that world look like, bro? What does that world look like? Can you imagine the year 2087? What does 2087 look like? You know what scares me? The year 2087 techno te technologically, you know, might be lit. But as a society where we'll be. Our mind state. Where are we going to be in, 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 in 60 years? <laughs> Some ghouls. I'll be honest. I really think the P in the LGBTQ is going to get added. If you know what I'm talking about. I think that normalization of unaliveness and our mental state is going to be gone. Our dependency on AI will be complete. Skynet, full effect, Terminator, 100%. Looper, my, my dude. <laughs> Looper status. Uh, even as far as political violence. We're seeing that already in 2024.